Dutch Harbor, Alaska, home of Alaskan crab fishing, and the infamous Elbow Room. Well, we're here delivering and uh, maybe touch bases on the Elbow Room, now known as Latitudes. It's always been the Elbow Room to us. Now under a different name, this little bar has earned a big reputation in the more than four decades it's been serving crab fishermen. I bought the bar, bought it in 1966 for $800. I uh, had it for 40 years, and I sold it recently for 400000 When we bought the bar from him, we had no money. I mean, literally blood, sweat, and tears to buy the bar. Then we sat down with Larry, and he goes, OK, now how much do you want for the name? We assumed that we got the name. So we were like, we had no more money. I mean, I, I was I, tapped out. So he says, well, then I guess you can't have the name. So we had to come up with the name. The synonym for elbow room is latitudes. I've been working at latitudes just about since they opened. The elbow room was crazy, kind of nuts. They did cocaine on the tables and they smoked their weed in the bathroom and there was sex in the champagne room and just everything happened at the elbow. First night I walked to the elbow room, about 20 guys piled out the door and commenced to get into this big John Wayne-esque bar brawl out the mud. So I just stand back, watch this whole thing unfold. Within a few minutes, all of a sudden, the band came off break, struck up a note, and every single brawl broke up. The guys walked back in the bar and commenced to drinking again. The bar's about to change hands once again, but sadly for the fishermen, the new owners plan to shut the place down. Apparently, it's going to close, which is really unfortunate. Uh, the place would be so missed. It's, if there was ever a historical landmark, the elbow room would be it. I heard that an elbow room chip, an elbow room drink chip, went for 85 bucks on eBay. But if you come in here on the right night and you have an elbow room coat on, you can sell it for 1,000 bucks. Yeah. It's always going to be the elbow to a lot of people. Every day I work, somebody's coming here and taking pictures, and they want to know where the old elbow room sign is, or they want to take a picture. Everybody wants to know where's the elbow room sign. And this is it. It was um, on the building when we purchased it. And actually, three people tried to steal it. So we took it off and brought it inside. That was posted inside. We're going to auction it off next Saturday night on our final day of operation. <laughs>